The bite of a fluffy cat on the street can be more dangerous than you might think. In the United Kingdom, a 48-year-old who was bit by a stray feline ended up contracting a species of bacterium that scientists have never seen before. His immune response to the foreign microorganism was a doozy. Just eight hours after receiving multiple bites, the man's hands had swollen to such a great extent that he took himself to the emergency department. His puncture wounds were cleaned and dressed and he was given a tetanus shot before being sent on his way with antibiotics. A day later, he was back at the hospital. His pinky and middle fingers on his left hand were painfully enlarged and both his forearms were red and swollen. Doctors had to surgically remove the damaged tissue around his wounds. He was also given three different antibiotics intravenously and was sent home with oral antibiotics. This time, thankfully, the treatment worked and he made a full recovery. Back at the hospital, however, doctors were busy trying to figure out what had happened. When they analyzed the microorganisms present in samples from his wounds, they found an unrecognizable streptococcus-like organism. Streptococcus is a genus of gram-positive bacteria that is linked to meningitis, strep throat, bacterial pneumonia, and pink eye, among many other ailments. But when researchers sequenced part of this bacterium's genome, it did not match any strains on record. This was a new germ that scientists had never formally documented. As it turns out, the bacterium belongs to another genus of gram-positive bacteria called Globocatella. Full genome sequencing of the bacterium suggests that it differs from other related strains, like g sulfidfacians by around 20% indicating a distinct and previously undescribed species.